trashed me. Monkey minds. Trashed in me. Trashed in me. That said, since we're still pretty early, since we're still pretty early on, let's go ahead and get the second world taken done out of the way. All right, all right. Like honestly, I think I think I mean what I could end up what I probably will end up doing with these with this uh with this game is probably just you know uh, split them to chunks split them to chunks while, while still being like a play, treating it more like a like a typical Odyssey session where it's more like a very long recording and I just split up after that. Yeah, it's everyone's Honest. favorite Donkey Kong friend, the frog. It's Winky! You know, honestly, like, now that I think about it, because, you know, just for a little behind-the-scenes thing, uh, we're technically getting started on recording this about, like, an hour earlier than what we usually do. If we... <laughs> oh, boy. Bye, Winky. The frog did not help me. Continue. I was about to say, like, since we technically are starting earlier than we usually do, if we want to let go Gung Ho, we could potentially record the whole, record the whole thing in a day. I mean, we could. I don't know. My, my my current skills and display are not letting us. Oh yeah, we need Winky for that. <sighs> I need I want I need my giant dick. There you go. Someone had to have done it bad. I don't know. My current skills on display here. I don't feel too confident. I mean, me beating this game. For those that are not in the know, how yes, Winky Winky is British slang for dick, and how that yes. got passed into the censors is beyond me. Well, Wait, I think we, we brought that. Oh. I think we brought that up with Banjo Kazooie because you know Winky Bunyan. Oh right. <gasps> What were eh, you thinking? That was, I don't know what I was thinking. In fact, funnily enough, I think I was the one that brought up the fact that, of like, oh, if that's what Winky Bunyan means, that gives the frog and DKC a whole new meaning. Yeah, you did say that. It's like, it's true. Whoop. There you go. But yeah, I'm just going to skip it. We're just going to careful. The lighting on these platforms can be tricky to see the edges. A bit. Honestly, it's really not that hard. And yeah, I there don't remember you go. this level All giving me a lot of life. problems. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. And There's my skill. It was right here all along. Oh great, what's that? It's my ego. It was right in Winky's walkway. Now let's play with let's go on the minecarts. Alright. You're up, Diddy! Time to earn your license! You know, since you threw him off the edge, it would have been funny if it just kept going like he didn't respawn. <laughs> it's like Diddy! Diddy? Oh, DK, yeah, is this really my, gonna, my, the only way for me to earn my driver's license? Oh, that's right, he's in the barrel, not outside. I mean, we're, mo we're monkeys and gorillas, how can we learn driver's licenses? Well, it's, it's simple, Diddy. I mean, heck, look at my friend Mario, he got me my license. Ah! Oh. <laughs> and I'll, I'll hold on, good, it did you. The timing of that, I'm sorry, I, I thought I would just fall safely onto the next cart, but also I was just thinking in my head, like, Freaking like, do, uh, why do they? What, what do you think compelled them to make dated pop songs be DK's like whole like mantra? Well, in the, I... in the show, I don't really know. Like honestly, the way I imagine it is that I feel like, like the writers were like listening to like some of the demo takes from some of the actors, realized, hmm, you know, a handful of them are actually pretty good singers. Why don't we give them a chance to strut their stuff? I mean, to their credit, the, the musical numbers for the most part are pretty good. I mean, cheesy as all get out, but good. Yeah, I mean, I mean, who doesn't love, uh, who doesn't love, like, if people love the cheese in Sonic, why can't we love the cheese in Donkey Kong? I mean, as stupid as it is, I still love that Leo Luster song. Oh, yeah, oh no, that's really fun. Like, a lot of the songs are just oh. like, oh boy. I got crash, Diddy. flat crash. Diddy, you better, you better earn that license. Oh boy. Earn it now and help and revenge me. Oh, jeez! Oh, oh. They never you know, talked to me about cars driving in the same lane against you. You know what? I'm just imagining, like, maybe this whole thing is another episode of the cartoon where Kuro's like, If I'm able to sabotage Donkey Kong's attempt to get a driver's license, then the crystal coconut will be mine. Then we'll never see <laughs> come in. Man, I'm I'm forgetting. You know, I, I'm you know maybe reminded. I don't have. To, you know, maybe I don't have to put a whole lot of effort in my plan after all. I'm gonna be very honest. I'm very quickly like being reminded of why these games, why many people were initially like freaked out a bit by uh, Tropical Freeze's difficulty when it was just you know, that. This is just this has always been Donkey Kong norm. Whoop. Is uh, well, honestly, not being, I would not argue... being brutal, but just being very uh, like. You have to. It, it, this requires a lot of reflexes. It was. Just, it was just one step above the uh, Mario games. Yeah, I was about to say. I, I wouldn't really like say they're completely on the wrong with it because as huh. fun as returns. Oh boy. 
As fun as Returns is, it does have a few dick dick moves here and there. Oh, of course. Like the air. Well, like the especially, bell. I still think back to, like, it was one of the minecart levels where you had to grab one of the Kong letters while also avoiding, like, those really big blue cr Hey! Yeah, it's like where it's walls. in a ducking section, and it's like right at the end where it's like you have to like time your jump perfectly to get it without hitting the roof you're currently ducking under. Yeah, it's and just ugh, that's easily the most bullshit part of the game, in my opinion. Well, that and from what I saw, I really did. I disliked the I disliked the minecart levels where you're not in the minecart but just on top of it. Just something with the physics those. of jumping with that felt a little bit odder to me. There I don't remember any of those levels being, like, huh? particularly taxing. At least none that are currently coming to me. You're almost there. Huh? I have faith in you, Diddy! Just don't put any uphill <laughs> climbs on me. And... There's the arrow. One more jump. Oh, I knew Whoop. it! I, I, was, I got ready. You saw it. I was jumping. I, was I like, warned you! They're gonna throw a dick at me. They're gonna do it. And I, I They were gonna throw it. a dickhead right in your path. Right there, and there he was. Yeah, honestly, real talk... I can't remember the last time we ever I ever struggled with minecart madness like this. Oop! This is the recording curse. It's begun. It really is. There was nothing that we could do to stop it. But we'll either cut this out and make ourselves look far more important and hope that nobody looks at the live counter too intensely. Oops. <laughs> Are you alright? <laughs> Just getting abused. I'm okay. See, hype is okay because he's in the he's in the, he's in the background just watching us, watching us. You, squirm. you know, if it's any consolation, if they ever do decide to put two on the SNES online thing, we'll cut you some slack, James, and I'll just be between me and Logan. He's in focus mode. Like, okay, cause now that. I shall legitimately earn my license. Okay, just just be careful. Okay, and then another one, and then. It's not this one, but the next level where they have you make a jump on an incline that I always freaked out about. And okay, then we do the rapid jumps, and then get ready for one last one right here. There you go. What if one well, just popped up right there? <laughs> it's like, my, buddy did, did. my buddy Diddy did. My buddy didn't get to earn his license, but I did. Knocks Donkey Kong into the abyss. He's going. Come to think of it, where is Diddy? Oh. Diddy little bunny. So yeah, by this point, we sh things should be a little easier on us because it's actual platforming, and the next minecart level won't be for another few worlds. Okay. Yeah. So, I I do also like what they were doing with this project with Donkey Kong. Just to also toss that out there. I enjoyed how they um nice. I also like how they were. It was a very interesting move to like go this path with Donkey Kong, given almost all the information they had to start with was just from that one arcade title. Yeah, and I mean, look, look up the look up some of the um, pre-development factoids behind Donkey Kong Country, and just be amazed by how radical some of their ideas were. Like the first initial pitch for the game was actually against was hacked with was with DK going up against Wario. Yeah, there's that, and I remember they had like a bunch of different like designs for Karul. Like he looked a lot more realistic and intimidating at first before we got the big doofy croc we have now. You see, yeah. I mean, I still think his eyes are weird and creepy. Hey, Winky. Well, that's the point. Hey, Winky! Let me see. Oh, also another thing uh, that some people might have seen this, but I remember this one, um, this one 3D artist actually made this really interesting video where it's like, it took footage of like the first one or two levels of Donkey Kong Country, and they pretty much edited so that it's like, what if they made Donkey Kong Country, but Nintendo was more liberal about them using the arcade design, and like... I remember... I remember we, I think we brought that up during our Donkey Kong 94 uh, commentary, right. where like, like yeah, they took that design from the from that game and applied it to the actual art style of that. And I'm just thinking to myself, like, I mean, I still love the direction they went with the Donkey Kong Country series or the Donkey Kong series in general. After this point, a part of me is definitely curious to imagine what that would that would have been like if Nintendo asked them to make a design more like that. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I mean, like, like it definitely. Like how far, like with how with how DK would be treated from then, from the, there on out. Right, got it. Or or like what any of the other DK characters would have looked like under that Miyamoto style. Well, I know Diddy would know it wouldn't be a thing. Like it, it would still be DK Junior. And I mean, yeah, beyond that, I'm not really sure. Yeah. Mm. All right, Diddy, time for a horror level. 
Yay. Oh, yeah. The stop and go station, where you have literally the only indestructible enemy in the game, the Rock Crocs. I feel like... I think someone, like, did, like... I don't know if it was, like, a hack, but some kind of video where it's, like, I think if you use the slam attack on them at the right moment, you can technically, like, kill them. That was only possible in the Game Boy Advance port. Oh. Also, Diddy, it's also... Logan, I know, I know you want to take this slow and steady, but this is literally one of those levels where you really gotta go Oops. blazing fucking fast in. Like and I so. Got, I, oh, ah! Oops. <laughs> okay. Not like that, Grant. Trip, trip on the one thing I was that, not ready that's for the that. real. That's the real horror movie. Well, I just I thought I could roll into them, but I don't think you can. I don't think you're allowed to roll into them because of their teeth. Oh yeah, no, the clap traps. Yeah, the, the clap traps are literally designed to be an anti roll anti roll enemy. Duly noted. Also, um, I gotta I gotta make use of my roll jump move. Yeah, because yeah. because it was with this game that proved that monkeys can indeed defy fit, defy the laws of gravity. And it's glorious. It's literally become a it's literally become a running gag at this point. Even yeah. in the Return series. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I'd argue in the Return series, it's a lot more, like, fundamentally required. Oh, of course. Oh, yeah, they, they've definitely started, like, positioning things over... Like, right here, like, how am I supposed to get that without a roll jump? Safe. Know. Like so. So, yeah, I think, they, I think they already were aware of it. Like, they thought it was an exploit at the time, but then they realized... No, this could be, this could be really fun, actually. Uh-oh. Oh. Careful. Well, there goes your barrel. Crap. Huh. Well, again, we're not going for all the bonus rooms, so it's not like we're not like it's really going to be much of a loss. Ah! Well, that could be a loss in and of itself. So you have added now. I'm done. I'm, I'm tired. I'm not your tired. turn, I'm DK. I'm scared. I am scared. Marty, I'm scared. And then Donkey Kong's freaking and just gets all freaked. I mean, so. I also don't. I, I also didn't mind this the, the the style chosen at first, where they he was like you know they were just using full on like archived clips of of a gorilla's uh, <gasps> of a gorilla's oh. like sound and stuff. But I also oh, I, I can I, 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 I can understand the cartooniness that they're going for with with the more with I mean like the more modern DK. There we go. I mean honestly, I'm surprised it took so long for them to even give DK a proper voice. And they still will never acknowledge it in Smash. Yeah. yeah. Neither him, nor King K. Rule, nor Diddy, nor Bowser. Huh? And oddly, and, and that's what's weird. It's that, like, Bowser Jr. still has huh? his game voice, but not his, but not his old man. Nope. That is weird. Okay, careful. Jump. Jump. Like, honestly, I figured... Honestly, I figured they might as well, like... If they're gonna go, go for broke and make Bowser Jr. sound like a baby velociraptor. Oh gosh! Oh, baby just, uh, uh, oh, this is gonna suck. Yeah, you gotta just Woo. nudge it to the side. Oh lordy, Lou! And come on. What is he trying to do now? The the tire, the tire is stuck. So he, I, he's moving back far enough so he can despawn and hopefully be in a better position. So he needs to push it from. The I didn't left. have this much trouble with the goddamn level before. There. Okay, we're out of here. Just just run. And that's the and that's literally the point where they try to give you a quick scare. Oh, there you go. Doo -doo. We're almost done with Candy! It. Candy! I'm scared! Help me! <laughs> Candy, hold me! No, not public. <laughs> not unless it's a fan game, maybe. Maybe. Actually, speaking of fan games, uh, remember when some fan actually did try to make their own DKC4, which lets you play as all four of the Kongs from the previous three games? Really? Yeah, it was something. It was interesting. My only real critique with it is that the controls were iffy. Aww. Mm. So, and then those Kongs only DK can kill and or Diddy Kongs. with a... And or Diddy with a TNT barrel. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the Crushers you can only kill with, kill with um, a barrel if you're Diddy. If you're DK, you can, just, you can still jump on them, so there's yeah. that. But Ooh. otherwise, they're, they have they have abs of steel. Really? No, it is. <laughs> and, he's, and DK's like, I wish I had abs of steel. I only have abs. I only have ab I only have these weak, pathetic arms. He says as he punches the moon. <laughs> well, hey, that wasn't a thing. That wasn't canonical at that point. You have Retro to thank for that. Yeah, Retro put him to a very strict diet plan. Got him shaped up. Got him yeah. ready to take on cosmic horrors. Yeah, that's like they they observed the. Uh, which team was it that did Jungle huh. Beat again? Nintendo. 
that okay. was uh, that was that was literally the galaxy team. Okay, so oh, the galaxy really? team was like they put Donkey Kong through like an intense regimen. Then Retro just took notes. It's like, okay, so we got that. That got results. We're gonna do some alterations because, gonna be frank, you were kind of insane in that. And we 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 don't want to go like too nutso in this game. Yeah, I mean, DK I mean, we'll yeah. may be too, strong, but I don't think he's capable of taking out gods. Yeah, no, it's like I don't know, like. Oh, oh hey, look wait. at him! He's he's pre oh jeez! Oh. Oops! He's befriending a sink. Okay, it's okay. It's okay, Winky. It's okay. Also, now I love the idea of like all. Oh Ooh, boy! There goes there your goes. Winky. He, he has not had an easy life. That's why we don't see him in the future games. All the coconut to the head. Oh, coconut cream pies! But yeah, what was it? Um. Oops. Yeah, what was it say? It's just like um. Just in general, it's like I love the idea of them being like, okay, no, we saw what you did there, and we're gonna have to downgrade you. We can't have you just punching things in the face. We're gonna have you punching the moon. Did we say downgrade? We meant upgrade. I mean, yeah, that's literally the most badass thing DK's ever done throughout his entire gaming career. And yeah. Diddy has the the head of an iron of an iron maid. Yeah, the board. I yeah, what's seriously. funny? Is Oh yeah, because we're like, if you manage to win it as returns in returns as Diddy, it's by accident, mind you. He headbutts the Devil Damn Moon. I mean, the fact that they, they even made an alteration for Diddy, considering the fact you can only play them in multiplayer mode, I mean, that's that's dedication right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That makes me wonder, like, it's dedication, but it's like really goes to show. It's like, let's operate under the assumption that someone's gonna pull the old trickaroo. And like have two players then turn the first one mode off just to play it's just Diddy. I guess and oh nice. boy. I'm not even gonna chance it. Just get me to the exit. There you are. <laughs> Take me home! I don't want any of them bananas and So I guess before we head on to our next boss, let's see what Cranky has to say to old Diddy. Ah. Sure, come on over! Beach talking to my shelf! Bet you thought this was 64 bits, eh, boy? Well, that's right, it was 32 back, back, 32 bit back then. It was like Atari had 64 bits. I got more gameplay in my little finger than you've gotten this whole game. Please don't show me that finger again. You know what they say, all graphics and no gameplay. You know, I find it funny that like when he does like the cane beaten thing, it's like DK reacts to it, but D just takes it like a champ. He is a man. Back in my day, we used to have real gameplay. A, le a leap of faith is all it takes to- Yeah, it usually uh, by the, like, the fifth or something, he'll just give you like some sort of, um, proper... clue. Yeah. All right, and unfortunately, with, I, unfortunately, it's with with the original game, it was all very randomized. So yeah, let's take out Nicky and his nuts. Just bonk there him you on go. the- Oh, you can't bonk him on the head. No, you, you, you to, can, you, gonna, you just- You have to wait for him to actually spit out his nuts first before you bonk him on the head. Oh. Yeah. Ooh. You're the, do you're I have the, to do all? Do I have to do all the work here? You're the uh, you're the beefier of the two. You are the clearly the strongest. I mean, you're an 800 pound gorilla. What do you think's gonna be more effective? I don't I don't get my gun until the next game. No, not uh, even. Then. Next generation, next console. There, he's dead. And so we taken out a lot and taken out a very humongous vulture. A vicious vulture. <laughs>